rebound. All right, let's go. Pumps, one, two, three. It's been a long year. It's been a hard year. Three months have passed since a young man from northeast Colorado was killed in a car crash on his way to school. Cole Rhodes had recently transferred to Caliche High so he could play basketball on his cousin's team. As Nine News storytellers Kevin Torres and Chris Hansen show us, the Caliche Buffaloes made it to the state championship finals this weekend where they played for their teammate, Cole. Let's take it to him right from the start. There they go. Get around him. Up the court. Watch him, Joel. Watch him, Joel. Moving fast. Don't be lazy now. Take care of it. All right, rebound. Without a care in the world. <laughs> hey, hey, official. You can't do that. Right, let's go rebound right here, all right? Oh, my gosh. You're not going to call a foul? The only fouls in this game are coming from the mouths of the fans sitting in the stands. You can't do that. Hey, why? Good, Andrew. This is a team focused on winning, yeah. knowing all too well what it's like to lose. We had Cole Rhodes that was killed this year in a car accident right after Christmas break. Kids that are 15, 16, 17 years old aren't used to having to deal with that sort of thing. His teammates were his family. It was really tough, and it still is. And from the stands, his mother watched over them like a guardian angel. I still have that angel. It's in his pocket right now. She gave Cole that trinket when he was a little boy, and he held on to it till the day he died. I think he's here. He's watching us. He's helping the team. Mitch, stand right next to him. Chase, you stay back. How Cole would have wanted to be here this day to play with his cousins. But I know that Cole would want us to be here for Tyson and Austin and the whole team. A match so important. There's a chance. Kalichi couldn't let it end without a win. <laughs> One, two, three, go! With their fists held high, reaching to the heavens, Cole's parents knew their son was reaching back. It's been a long year. It's been a hard year. This was about more than a win. He was with us. <laughs> it was about family, community, the person they loved, and ultimately, the person they lost. I love you guys. I love you so much. This was for Cole. I knew they could do it. I knew they could do it. With photojournalist Chris Hansen, this is Kevin Torres, 9 News. The Buffaloes defeated Sierra Grande by a final score of 84 to 77. This is the fourth straight year the Buffaloes won the Class 1A Boys State Championship.